It's not over yet. We've seen the activity move from the south of the state to the north of the state. And in particular, uh, the worst fire currently is the fire in the Warrumbungle National Park uh, near Coonabarabran. This is a very large, very hot and very fast moving fire. Uh, this is the same fire that damaged the facilities at the Siding Springs Observatory. Um, thankfully, the main building and the telescope, uh, miraculously, uh, has been saved. But I'm sorry to say that uh, some 28 uh, residential properties have been confirmed lost in this fire, and that's in addition to some 40 uh, farm sheds. There's also been extensive stock loss uh, and loss of farm machinery and fencing. Uh, this fire continues to burn, uh, thankfully, uh, not towards the main population centre of Coonabarabran uh, due to a change in the wind. It now is burning northwards, uh, so there is some concern around some of the other communities to the north of the Warrumbungle National Park. Uh, those communities include Barradine and Gwabigar. Uh, this fire is receiving maximum attention from our firefighters, and I want to uh, place on record uh, my thanks uh, to each and every one of those firefighters, uh, be they from the Rural Fire Service, the State Forests uh, and National Parks and Wildlife Service. Our personnel have been magnificent in the field and I pay tribute to them and their families uh, for the contribution that they've made to ensure uh, that through this week uh, there's been no loss of life. Uh, this is the important thing we have to remember uh, to this stage, yes, property's lost, uh, but nobody has perished 